Yes, and empty your mind. Hey everybody, it's Master Wanish here and I welcome you to today's lesson. If you haven't already, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, one inch punch that bell notification and give these videos a thumbs up if you can. Now today I'll be talking a little bit about flow and using flow within your psyllium towel form. You're gonna hear me talking a lot about flow in the lessons to come, especially when we get into more partner training and flow drills and adaptation. But today I'll be talking about flow and applying that to your psyllium towel form, the form we've been working on in this channel. Once again, the psyllium towel form, psyllium towel meaning way of the little idea, and this is the first form of the Wing Chun system. It's the most basic form of our system as it's teaching us to move energy in and out the center of our body, but it's also the most advanced form of, the, of our system as well. Once you go through the psyllium towel, advanced psyllium towel, chum Q, bill G, wooden dummy, uh, you can circle back to the psyllium towel form and really study this as more of a qi gung form, um, working on your internal qi. Now, today I'm just talking briefly about flow. When I teach the psyllium towel form, especially when you've seen me break it down section by section, it seems very robotic. We're going here, here, back, here, punch, and I'm kind of doing it very robotically so you can really grasp every piece of the form, every section of this puzzle and get the form in complete detail. But at this point, if you've been practicing, uh, I think we're over 30 days of lessons now, you should be really having the whole form down, understanding the detail, and now you can start putting the flow together. Each set should be flowing into the next. Each piece should be flowing into the next. So as I'm doing a, uh, the form, everything's flowing right out. There's really no breaks. It's very smooth. It's very fluid. So today we'll run through the psyllium towel form together. I will be applying this fluidity and flow into the form and you can follow along as best you can. Once again, I'll be your mirror. I'll be starting with my right. You're going to do your left side and let's get started. So let's go our feet together. Everybody take a deep breath in and let it out. One more deep breath in and out. Here we go.
Excellent. So when you're doing the form, you don't have to worry about speed. You can do it nice and slow. You can really, and the flow can still be happening. And I suggest do it really slow and just let every piece flow from one to the next. And one of the most beautiful things I love about the Silum Tau form is when I'm doing the form, I'm so present. And so many times in our life, um, we're living in the past or we're living in the future. And when you're doing your forms, you're really just in the present. You're in that moment. You're doing, you're focusing. Everything you're doing is right there in that moment. You're really living in the moment. It's just a reminder to live in the moment, not in the past. Don't stress about the future. Live in the moment, take control of your life, make the decisions that are right for you right then and there. So that's it, just a very quick lesson today. I will have more lessons coming in in the near future. And just a reminder, as I mentioned, and I've been doing daily lessons, but I might have to um, do just a few a week instead of every day, but you will be seeing plenty of lessons from me. As long as we're on this lockdown or this quarantine, these lessons will keep coming. I am in a bit of a hot spot, so I know they're mentioning about opening up certain parts of the country. I have a feeling um, this will probably be one of the last zones in the country uh, to be open, so um, I'll still be here. And even after the quarantine, I'm still gonna be posting, publishing, growing the community, the channel, and I'm always here to answer any of your questions. So if you have questions, leave comments down below. If there's anything you'd like me to cover, leave it in the comments section down below. I look forward to seeing you soon. Once again, please do me a favor. If you haven't already, you made it this far, give the video a thumbs up. That would be great. Just show me you're watching, you're enjoying these videos, and I look forward to seeing you soon. I hope you and yours are well. Take care.